Just tell us about how it kind of came together. Um, well, about three years ago, I was going through, like everybody in the world, going through um, a change of scenery with um, you know, partners in life. You know, and uh, I needed an outlet, and my old band wasn't the right kind of style of music, so I started The Hounds Below three years ago in my head and started writing songs, and uh, two and a half years later, I'm in, I'm in The Hounds Below on tour playing the songs that I wrote about heartache and misery and all that. You know, hence, a song called Heartache and Misery. I'm not that witty when it comes to song titles. It's basically, you know, what it is. And uh, yeah, and so we tour, and we're new, and we're always changing members, adding horns, getting rid of horns, adding keyboard, getting rid of keyboard, always changing. Still, you know, trying to find the right fit for the band. And we're still pretty new, and um, yeah, we've already done four tours, I think, in six months or seven months, so. So you have, like, new material coming out in the next? Um, probably. I mean, th the thing is, is my, in the other bands I've, I've been in, my friends' bands, it only takes two years before you do your first tour. We were banned for less than a month, and we left for the West Coast, and we did South by Southwest, so. Um, we kind of skipped a bunch of things. Like, now we're kind of doing grassroots, just going out and playing clubs in front of people that seem to still like music, which we're finding still exist. They're not just people listening to just iPods all day, you know, and going to rap shows. Rap shows are great. I'm not a good rapper, so. Yeah, well, it's definitely a different style from what you were doing in your previous band, which you yeah. were with Hounds Below. Yeah, yeah, yeah no, the Hounds Below is way more crooner oriented, and, um, it's a different kind of fun. I'm not as angry in this band. Maybe a little bit of sad, a little bit more hopeful at the same time, but in and, and, uh, my old band, it was more, more angry. I'm not angry anymore, you know. I've gotten to that age, the ripe old age of not being angry, so, yeah. And I was curious too, so, you know, as far as, the, you know, things have changed the way people distribute music now, yeah. and that type of thing, so, I mean, compared to what you were doing before, yeah. you know, like on a, on a record label, and now a lot of people kind of do things kind of on their own. So. Well, when, when I first started doing my other band, there wasn't MySpace yet. There was Friendster, I think, but they didn't really have music on there. And um, so we were kind of in the midst of uh, the, I, the iTunes store and all that existing. And um, we kind of came right before it got really big, my old band. And um, now it's, the first thing we did is put out a seven inch and not put anything available online which maybe I'm just a dinosaur, but uh, I like putting out vinyl. You know, I really do like putting out vinyl. And um, we'll probably give away everything for free in the end. You know, it's music, music, uh, I don't know, I just want people to come to shows. All band shows, good or bad. I don't care if the band's bad, you should go to their show. Yeah, live music. Yeah. Live music, live music. You can go home and play rock band anytime, you know. So what are you guys looking forward to in the next year with, with Hounds Below? What do you got planned? Well, right now, this is our first date of a 21-day trek across the West Coast. And, um, it ends in L.A., and then we drive home from L.A. And, um, I don't know. I think just that right now. We're, we're enjoying this new tour, and we have a new guy playing bass with us, and um, a friend of ours, Eric, is playing keyboard. And, oh, actually, I've never been in an all-guy band. It's, it's crazy. It's way crazier. I don't know why, like no offense, like I, I've had really fun people in my band that happen to be female in my old band, but uh, I've never been in an all-male band. It's really strange. I mean, 12 years of playing music and I've never played with guys. You know, one guy my whole life, my old drummer. You know, now it's like I got five energetic guys in my band and it's, uh, it's, it's a circus. It's really a circus, so, yeah. That's